Welcome to Workplace Violence Prevention, Creating a Safe and Caring Workplace, written and produced by The Training Factor. I'm not concerned with you liking me or disliking me. All I ask is that you respect me as a human being. Jackie Robinson Introduction Workplace harassment is illegal and destructive to any organization. It is important to treat everyone in the workplace with respect and dignity. Workplace harassment must be identified, discouraged, and prevented in order to keep a hostile work environment from developing. Left unchecked, harassment can escalate into violence. Workplace harassment training is essential to the welfare of all businesses and their employees. Objectives Research has consistently demonstrated that when clear goals are associated with learning, it occurs more easily and rapidly. At the end of this workshop, participants should be able to Define workplace harassment Understand bullies and how to avoid hiring them Create a risk assessment and understand how to handle violence Recognize social and business responsibility Develop relevant policies and procedures Learn how to investigate complaints. Being brilliant is no great feat if you respect nothing. Goethe You cannot fool all of the people all of the time. Abraham Lincoln Chapter 8 Interview Process The interview process is designed to help employers find the best employees for open positions. Employers need to always apply the interview process carefully and never hire an employee out of desperation. Identifying potential bullies in an interview will save you the trouble of dealing with their problems later. Identify a bully in the interview process. Bullies may be able to hide their destructive behavior, but hiring managers should pay attention to the clues that indicate a candidate may be a bully. If you believe a candidate to be a bully, do not hire him or her. Impressive qualifications will not help your company if you allow a bully to destroy morale and run off your best employees. Interview Hints Overusing I Candidates should discuss their achievements, but they need to have experience working as part of a team. Behavior in office. Observe how the candidate treats subordinates in the office. Check references. Pay attention to how references describe the candidate. Warning signs. When interviewing a candidate, it is important to determine whether or not the individual is capable of empathy. Ask the candidate to describe a particularly frustrating time. Listen to the tone carefully. Is it disparaging? Is the body language tense and angry? Ask the candidate to describe how he or she would handle a problem with an employee. If the individual shows signs of anger or frustration again, you are probably interviewing a bully.